so many other opportunities in football even if you decide to stay in the industry mm. um, there's so many things you can do outside from playing yeah. right uh, and so you know i think one of the manifesto points if you see is to expand the dream yeah right and expand the dream is that you go beyond just playing on the game um if you if you want to stay in the game what other things could you mm. do mm. um and then how do you then become um um a shining light to your community so that others mm. can have opportunities mm. That sounds great. What I really like, you know, speaking to you here is you've you've tapped into that purpose. You've got right. a background in education, leading schools in America. So you're still doing some work in America. You love your football. Yeah. So you're actually doing the football. So you're amalgamating lots of things that are important right. to you. And then you're kind of following it through with a real purpose. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it, I'm, you know, you, the way you describe it, right, sounds wonderful, right? It's like... <laughs> Happened by accident, <laughs> Eddie. Yeah, so for me, as you sort of briefly said in the intro there, paddleboarding and adventure has been my tool for growth. It's my tool for change. And I suppose ultimately my tool for rehabilitation. I have been to prison and one a muscle I came up with whilst I was inside was through adventure we live. And I try to live by that every day. But also whilst I was inside, I realized how broken our system is in the UK. So I work as a consultant for the criminal justice system as well. And I use my adventures as a platform to highlight the importance of reform and rehabilitation, show others that our past mistakes don't define who we are, try and change perspectives on people like myself, but ultimately try and get more people to reconnect themselves to an adventure like, like I'm doing right now. A different demographic to what was in London. In London, the school was located near Shoreditch, so the students would walk to school and probably walk past some techie entrepreneur hipsters on the way and start to see <laughs> where education could take them. And they've got Canary Wharf in the skyline, yeah. um, whereas it wasn't it wasn't quite the same in Woodhouse. Mm. You know, the, the, it was a challenge to engage families in the value mm. of education, but once you had them, it's just fantastic. You mentioned about the principle being inspirational. So what was it about the principle that you found inspirational? I talk a lot to my students about this and it's, I think it's humility. Um, she was incredibly humble and she, I think there is a misconception that it's the TED talkers and the, the very extrovert school leaders that are the most memorable and the most successful. And she just, she just wasn't like that. She was incredibly humble. She didn't say much more than she needed to. Um, and she was very good at listening, really actively listening. Visualize the fight, and I visualize everything. And I, I often, like, you know, I'll put my hand up, and I'll be like, "That's me winning." And it's that feeling, and that feeling it becomes very natural. And it's what you expect. That's fantastic, and I, I love the idea of the, the rhythms in terms of those combinations that, 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 that you're doing. Can you give me like a, a, an example of what that would look like in terms? Not that I'm an, a, an aficionado of boxing, but <laughs> what would that kind of thing look, look like? So if you're thinking about like um, a combination, maybe like a double jab cross, but you want the cross to be the more powerful one, you probably accent the cross. So that'd be the okay. accent in the, in the in the rhythm. So if you're playing it together and you may, maybe make the, the double jab staccato, you know, you make it short, that little way of thinking about it. And it's just, it was really clever that my coach managed to think a bit outside the box and, and like lock into something in my mind that is something completely different to what he understands. But it, it really helped me to learn.